look at the very top of the Empire State Building, where some of the low clouds there you can see, but you can't see any snowflakes because they're not here yet. But uh, some uh, treacherous weather around town. 31, 85 percent humidity, a gusty northeast wind, wind chill at double ones, which is the channel you always watch, 29.82 and falling, and we have a cloudy sky. Well, they do. They're watching now. Okay, five to seven inches. I know it seems like, well, where is it? It'll get here, folks. We think there'll be a pretty solid band of five to seven inch so snows and maybe a shade more on Long Island. And here it is on the radar. Now, this shot here of moisture has been mostly freezing rain with some sleet mixed in. We have some light snows back up through northern New Jersey, but what we're really interested in is this blossoming area of moderate snow across all of Pennsylvania down to Maryland, Baltimore, Washington, uh, moderate snow there, uh, starting to snow a little harder now in Philadelphia. That's all going to swing in. The problem tonight, and this is a Doppler radar view out of Brookhaven, the darker greens over Long Island, this is the freezing rain that has been hitting Suffolk County especially hard and into Nassau County and even into parts of Queens, uh, on up through the northern areas of the Bronx toward Westchester. This has been lighter snows. That has been the first focus of attention here. The second area, the spinning area, that is the upper air storm system. You notice that big white area blossoming out. This is where we're going to be grinding out our snows during the overnight period. Temperatures, a big issue at this point, 30 at Newark, 31 at LaGuardia, Islip at 31, Bridgeport at 29, and also with the winds, we've had a wind chill problem tonight with wind chills in the single digits. What's happening is we have cold air, now this was the profile perhaps a little earlier today, cold air has been draining southward and at the same time a strong upper air storm system has been swinging east, feeding some energy into this coastal storm, and when this swings around, Tonight into the first part of tomorrow morning, that's when we'll get into our big snows. After, say, 8 or 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, it'll all be gone. Our storm will be moving away, and we should start to dry things out nicely, although it will be cold into Monday. So for tonight, folks, snow's coming, heavy at times, 5 to 7 inches by sunup tomorrow, maybe a little bit more in the east end uh, or, or eastern areas. Temperatures in the 20s. Tomorrow, after some early snow, we'll break out into some sun. It will be windy, 27 to 32. And on the extended forecast, I think it'll be dry into Wednesday. Some of our computer models hinting that there might, may be another chance for snow Wednesday night into Thursday. Tune in tomorrow. Wow. Uh, the double ones update. to find out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank, thank you, you, Joe. All right, Sean is here now, and the Giants are supposed to be heading south pretty soon, we hope, with this weather. Yeah, their equipment left today. I don't know if it's going to get down there tomorrow with all this weather. Mm -hmm. The Giants leave.